Hello everyone, welcome back to Enthigyan. In this video, we will be solving one very interesting question from algebra for the real values of x. So let's get started. I will consider rationalization of denominator. So I need to multiply square root 5 minus 2 in the numerator and in the denominator. So we can write 80 square root 5 minus 2 over a plus b times a minus b we can write a square root 5 whole a square minus 2 whole a square using difference of a squares formula. So 80 square root 5 minus 2 over root 5 a square is 5, 2 a square is 4. So denominator will be 1. RHS 80 times root 5 minus 2. LHS was x cube minus 1, 1, 3. Now I can write x cube minus 113 equal to 80 square root 5 minus 160. Or we can write x cube will be equal to 80 square root 5 minus 160 plus 113 minus 47. Let's say this is our equation number 1. Because of 80 root 5 is greater than 47, we can say x cube must be positive. For real x, we can conclude x must be positive. Now I will write x cube equation here. 80 root 5 minus 47. Let us consider y cube, which is conjugate of x cube, 80 root 5 plus 47. Let's subtract second equation from first one. We will get x cube minus y cube. This will be equal to minus 47 minus 47 minus 94. Let's say this is equation 1. Now I will consider product of these two. So x cube times y cube will be equal to 80 square root 5 minus 47 times 80 square root 5 plus 47. Let's apply difference of two squares identity. So 80 root 5 whole square minus 47 whole square. So 80 square is 6400 times 5. We will get 32,000 here. 47 square is 2209. Difference will come out 29791, which is cube of 31. So LHS we have XY whole cube. RHS we have 31 whole cube. Once we will take cube root both sides, for real XY we will get XY equal to 31. I will say this is equation number 2. Let's solve. But before that friends, if you are an Olympiad aspirant or planning to do preparation for SOF, Crest, Unicus, Silver Zone, Asset, Indian Talent Olympiad, Hummingbird from grade 2 to grade 10, then Olympiad Success offers you live interactive sessions, PYQs, tests and many more. Please check out the description box for further details and use referral code GYAN15 to get 15% discount. Let's come back to our problem. Let me write our equations x cube minus y cube equal to minus 94 and x times y equal to 31. Now I will assume x minus y equal to m suppose. And I will use x minus y whole cube formula, which is x cube minus y cube minus 3xy times x minus y. So x minus y is m. I will write LHS m cube equal to x cube minus y cube. This is minus 94 minus 3 times xy 
this is 31 x minus y this is m so i can write m cube equal to minus 94 minus 93 m or we can write m cube plus 93 m plus 94 equal to 0. Now equation is cubic we can use method of factorization so I can write our equation as m cube plus 93 m I will write minus m plus 94 m 94 minus 1 is plus 93 plus 94 equal to 0. Now from first two terms we can consider m common so m square minus 1 from last two terms we can take 94 common so in the bracket we will get m plus 1 equal to 0. Now m square minus 1 is m square minus 1 square which we can write m plus 1 times m minus 1 using difference of two squares formula. Let us write m times m plus 1 times m minus 1 plus 94 times m plus 1 equal to 0. Now m plus 1 is common. So in other bracket we will be writing m times m minus 1 plus 94 equal to 0. I can write m plus 1 times m square minus m plus 94 equal to 0. So from here we can conclude either m plus 1 will be 0 or m square minus m plus 94 will be equal to 0. So let us solve this quadratic equation first. I will check the discriminant first. So the value of d will be b square minus 4ac. So I will write minus 1 square minus 4 times 1 times 94. So minus 1 square is plus 1. 4 times 94, 376. So our discriminant is coming out negative we can write this equation will generate complex solutions. So we will reject this quadratic as we are looking for real solutions. So m plus 1 equal to 0 or we can write m equal to minus 1. m was our substitution x minus y so I can write x minus y equal to negative 1. Or we can write y will be equal to x plus 1. Let us use this equation here y equal to x plus 1. Our equation second was xy equal to 31. So in place of y we will write x plus 1 equal to 31 or x square plus x minus 31 equal to 0. Equation is quadratic. We can use quadratic formula. As per formula minus b plus minus square root of b square minus 4ac over 2 times a. Here a is 1 coefficient of x square. b is also 1 coefficient of x. c is negative 31. So I can write x will come out minus 1 plus minus square root of 1 minus 4 ac will give us 124 over 2 times 1 so 2. Now I can write minus 1 plus minus square root 125 over 2. So we have two solutions x equal to the square root 125 minus 1 over 2 with plus sign in between and second minus 1 minus square root 125 over 2. 
so condition on x was x must be positive so we will reject the second one negative solution so i will write our answer as square root 125 minus 1 over 2 or we can write 5 root 5 minus 1 over 2 i hope friends you will like this video thank you so very much for watching do not forget to like share subscribe bye bye till next video good luck take care of yourself goodbye